Hello, Dennis Sellers from Maximum News On Demand here from News from the World of All Things Apple for Tuesday, October the 23rd, 2007. Sorry we didn't have one of the video updates yesterday, but I was busy covering the announcement of Apple's uh, fourth quarter finances uh, for the fiscal quarter that ended on in September. But speaking of which, let's look at Apple's astounding quarter and look at some of the numbers involved. Uh, Apple announced a 67% in fourth quarter profit, uh, topping, as usual, analyst estimate. Yes, in other words, Apple beat the street again. They also sold the record number of Mac computers and saw iPod and iPhone sales continue to grow. Uh, the share, Apple shares gained the most in nine months after the company uh, forecast sales and profit for this quarter that also beat analyst predictions, uh, which is something that unusual unusual in that Apple uh, was uh, more optimistic in their forecast than they usually are. Anyway, Apple says that they anticipate strong holiday sales uh, and another great quarter coming up. As for the third quarter that's just uh, that just ended or ended in sub September, Apple sold 2.10 million Macs during the back to school shopping season. Uh, that's the most Macs ever sold in a quarter. Uh, thanks to uh, back to school sales, uh, the unveiling of the aluminum iMac, which seems to be a hit, and continued hot sales for MacBooks and MacBook Pros. Uh, desktop sales were up 32%, uh, based mainly on the sales of the new iMac, although I hear that Mac Pro sales are also pretty brisk, or brisker than usual, uh, at this, uh, recently after the introduction of Adobe Creative Suite 3. Uh, as far as the laptop line, they continue to be really hot sellers and they count for an astounding 62% of total Mac sales at this point in time. Apple shipped 10.2 iPods and uh, the $200 price cut on the iPhone, controversial as it was, helped uh, the, uh, kickstart sales again on, on the communications device and Apple sold 1.12 million iPhones in the quarter, which was the first uh, full quarter that the device was on sale. Uh, fourth quarter net income rose to 904 million, or $1.01 per share. That's up from 542 million, or 62 cents a share, from the year ago quarter. Sales climbed 29% to 6.22 billion in the period that ended September the 29th. Uh, meanwhile, uh, Apple retail stores are setting new records as well. Uh, for the third fiscal quarter, they generated $268 million in revenue compared to $158 million for the same time period a year ago. Uh, right now, there are almost 200 Apple stores, and Apple says that in 2008, it plans to open at least 40 more retail stores, including new stores in New York, Boston, and for the first time, China. Now, I can assure you that, that three months from now, when the next round of uh, uh, Apple uh, fi finances are announced, they're going to beat the street again. Uh, or if they don't, it'll be an unusual trend because for, for several years now, they've always done better than Wall Street pundits predicted. Anyway, that's all for today's news. You can read more about these and a lot more stories at MaximumNews.com. Meanwhile, come back tomorrow and we'll have more news from the world of all things Apple. Until then, be good.